Good evening, everybody. We're now at part 40 of the uh, Rising Star career mode for James Cahill, aka me. Uh, and who am I? Well, I am our tea maker. Hello, how are you? I hope you're all well. Hope you're good. Hope you're having a nice day. Now, earlier on, you would have seen, if you'd watched the last episode of part 59, that we were in the European Masters final against Mark Allen. It started off well, we won five frames on the bounce. And then, then we kind of went off the rails a little bit. Uh, there was some real life stuff that came in which turned out to be okay. Turned out to be nothing serious. Turned out to be all good. However, that's put us into a 5-3 lead going into tonight's session. So, there's a potential of nine frames to be played tonight. Mark Allen needs six. I just need four. So let us see what will happen when we take on... I think it's like the potting... No, it's not the potting machine, is it? No. No. But he is someone. He is someone. He is one, one of the great on snooker. I don't remember his name. His nickname, anyway. So here we go. Hope you're all ready. Let us begin. So I said it's really, really, really important that I get off to a good start tonight. is really tricky. That could have finished a little better. Yeah, it One. should have finished a little better, but never mind. Left That's a shocker. James Cahill, one. He's playing for the right corner here. Nicely done. Is he going into the pack? One. Because Mark Allen will have went into the He'll to the interval. About that. A session interval, actually, really in good shape. Six. Hello, Michael. How you doing, good buddy? Mark Are you Allen, ready for some more six. snooker reaction? nice that was a fluke you were okay that's good that was a pure fluke this needs good striking here well you can't question his cue power yeah, time to sink pink down the ground <laughs> six and win me another trophy 
He's looking to pop this into the right corner. Don't go into the pocket. Oh. Got it off. Foul. James Cahill, six. Mark Allen, four. Start off with fouls again. <laughs> Yeah, this one potentially will be a very scrappy frame to begin with because it's going to be very nervy. This really is tricky. One. Good queuing required here. Strokes it in. Six. Uh, let's see which one we can get in. So again, remember, after four frames, seven. Should we need it, or have a mid-session interval where you can go have stretch your legs, grab your food, grab, grab drink, grab wee wee's, all that good stuff. And then if needed, we'll be back for the final nut, uh, five frames. Fourteen. Yes, he's taking the pot on. Brilliant shot. Just look at that for a positional shot. Superb. Fifteen. Now I'm going to again have to... Use the blue to come over to that side table. Well, I'm not surprised he's taking on the long pot here. Oh, I missed it. Miss hit no, it. No, not this time. That was a miss hit. James Cahill. That was 15. a bad miss hit. Aiming for the centre pocket here. And that was nowhere near the sweet spot. Nowhere near it. Decent position on the pink here. One. Could the nerves still be showing through for James Cahill here? Well, Mark Allen is struggling for form here. Well, Mark Allen has not come out Mark firing Allen, either. One. So that's a let off for James Cahill. One. However, this is not going to be easy. Tricky shot here. That's an absolutely outstanding pop. That's great cue ball control. Excellent position. Yeah, I, I need to get my act together for this one. So if I can get off to a good start by winning this frame. It'd be good. Six. See the blue can't get to. They're full ball snookers. He's taking it on. Well, that's just outstanding. Superb pop. And the cue ball has finished very nicely. Nice. Ten. The next one that goes off, you will be leaving. Eleven. Do I play it safe or go for the blue? He's going for the left corner pocket. A 
that's a bit sloppy. He's lost position here. 16. Ah, um, bloody controller ran out. Back in a second. Good job that didn't happen as I was taking the shot, wasn't it? Now, can he drop this into the right corner? That's a beauty. I think I'm on the black. He's finished think a I'm bit on the black. here. 17. On the red. <laughs> Twenty five. Oh, I'm hoping so, dude. Oh, that was a nice shot. Threaded the needle between the two reds. Thirty two. Important pot here. And in it goes. That should be it. No real way for his opponent to win the frame now. Now, I could go for this, try and lay up for that red, or or knock the blue to the court to the cushion, go up to the bulk. I think would be the safer route. It looks like he's going for the snooker behind the green here. Perfect. Well, he's managed the snooker. Let's see what happens here. James Cahill, 33. Frame conceded. Frame, James Cahill. And that is the frame. <laughs> we are 6 3. Thank you, the 10th frame. Mark Allen to break. It's a little bit of a wayward break off shot there. I mean, it's opened up the bunch a bit. Left me onto a shot to nothing. This is not easy. That's a good opening red. Thank you, dude. Thank you. One. So I'm tempted to go for the black. However, the pink runs into the bunch. This is a half chance. Five. I'm not sure what happened there. Seven. Should have hit a bit more power into that. Never mind what we could do. James Cahill, seven. He needs to be mindful of not under-hitting this shot. Just protecting the lead now, isn't it, really? <laughs> Excellent safety shot. It's a very tricky shot coming up. 
What a tremendous pop. What about that for a positional shot? Perfect. One. I'm not sure why it was wanting to put me into there. Long pot, right up his street. So Again, close, but he's much. missed it. That'll annoy him. Just too much over, over James the sweet Cahill, spot there. One. Not easy by any stretch, but hey. That's a top shot. Outstanding potting. He couldn't have played that any better. One. James Cahill, one. I'll do that. Safety play, he's got the... So now he's got to be attacking, open the reds up, you know. I don't have to be, I can play the single shots, get it safe. Well, it goes, half a chance. Outstanding pop, it's right out of the top drawer. Superb cue ball control there. Ideal position. One. Again, go at it again. He really doesn't want to under hit this shot. Because there's no real value of moving the blue from there. Great shot. James Cahill, one. Unless the bunch is opened like that. Now we can get going. Tricky pot, no doubt. Fabulous pot. Yes, he'll be very pleased with that shot. What can he do here? One. Give me that one. Right, let's see about getting. He's taking this red on. That's in. Excellent pop. Superb. Well, he couldn't have played that any better. Superb positional shot. Seven. This won't be easy. Tremendous pot. Brilliant. He'll be happy with that. Top shot. Now, if I can get the one that's next Twelve. to the pink in. He just wants to slot this into the middle pocket. That's an excellent pot. Like so. Great queuing there. Thirteen. See, I could go for the black, but the black will get caught by it on the spot. So there's no point in taking the black. He's lining this one up to the middle pocket. <laughs> this ain't eight ball. <laughs> you doing, James? Welcome in, me old mucker. 18. Nineteen. 
sure we could find some eight ball around the place. Uh, what I get? No, that won't. Okay, time to go for the black. He's looking to pop this into the left corner pocket. I'm okay. 26. Where am I? Ooh, I'm not. No. This is going to have to be a humdinger of a shot. Keep this break this going. Is no gimme. But it's in. Oh, that's a top quality shot with the rest. Not easy at all. That is in, my friends. 27. Well, not perfect position. No, I mean, we got that one there, but we got that one, which is a bit more difficult, but it would open up those other two. However, if I'm wanting to win the frame on this visit, 34. He's aiming to sink this into the right corner. Well, an excellent pop. Great technique. Opens up those viewing. reds as well. 40. So what, how many color, how many reds we got? Four reds, four blacks. Hello, Moon Princess, 41. welcome back. Nicely positioned for the red. Right, 47. So. This red required. No issues there. And that effectively shuts out his opponent in this frame. So the tactical play there. Worked. Right, Worked a treat. Not an easy one, but a half chance. What a pop! Amazing. Now, do I go for the one along 53. the top cushion? Do I go for this one, which I could do? He's aiming for the left corner here. Excellent pop. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 54. Let's do it this way. So, this pot into the right corner. Down I mean, I doubt I'm going to get a century here, but you never know. 57. You never, never know. Oh, ho, 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 ho. 58. Oof. This is not easy. Well, K James K, who has come out the better, stronger person tonight, has won the first two. This won't be easy. Oh, yes, what a pop! Sixty-three. Not an easy one, but a half chance. See what we can do here. Tremendous potting. Onto the yellow, so colours left. 
70. Just the colours remaining on the table now. Tremendous pot. 72. Now to get down to the, the brown ball. Not bad. 75. I was just wrestling and just a way to play my new game in a bit. The Disney Sorcerer's Arena. Where the ladders and Kung Gaia draw party. We know what a prolific long potter he is, so I'd assume he'd take this on. Great shot. 84. He'll want this to drop into the centre pocket. Okay, this one, this one's not going to be easy. <laughs> For a ninety-seven break, this won't be easy. It's there, ninety-seven break. Brilliant clearance, fantastic play. To go seven free up with two at least to play. 97 and the frame James Cahill that's the frame in the bag James Cahill leads 7 frames to 3 thank you the 11 frame James Cahill to break cheers dude That's not terrible, but gives him a shot. The rest makes this a little more difficult. Oh, that's a nice shot. That was a quality opening red. Oh, yeah, it's got snakes and ladders, but with words. Oh, so what? If you get the words wrong, you go down snakes. So can Mark Allen come back? Six. After a break of 97. No, you lose a turn. Oh, okay. But if you roll and turn dice, you still go down to it? Does it use dice? Nicely onto the colour. Seven. Good split. That's really opened the table up here. Wow. Fourteen. Well, if Mark Allen wins this frame, then we will have a mid-session interval. Twenty. He's aiming for the left corner here. Okay. <laughs> 21. The fact that he's forced to use the rest makes it a little trickier. So our mobile game's then getting a bit more um, creative. He's played that very well with the rest. 28. There we go, Mark Allen's response. Seen James Cahill win Nicely two on the bounce. On the 29. 36. He's just looking to drop this in gently. Thirty-seven. 
37. He's really a picky wee mobile game set. He's lining this up. Well, he needs to be really, because right they are thinking, pocket. aren't they? They can be cash guzzlers. 42. Decent position to take on a colour here. 43. Mark Allen is not giving up this match without a fight, I can say that. Because <laughs> the thing is, if he doesn't win this, he's almost at the point of no return. He'll want this to drop into the centre pocket. That's a great pot. He's playing very well here. He can afford to lose one more frame. 51. But anything else, that's it, game over for him. Not easy with the rest. Oh, that's a nice shot. Impressive shot with the rest. And he's on the red. 56. So, two more reds, two colours. He's won the frame. It'll be 7-4. Oh, well, no. What's happened the there? there? Careless. Foul. Wow. Mark Allen, 56. James Cahill, 4. He looks to be playing on here. Well, he's looking at potting this into the right corner pocket. That's a top shot. Well played. One. I've got to see what, what I can do here. That's a really good split, and this is a real opportunity. Eight. No, I can't get to that one. can get to that one however now can he drop this into the right corner beautifully done nine mm. pink it's got to be just wants to sink this into the left corner pocket in it goes Okay, now I have a choice. I'm going to split those two 50. reds up. Well, he's taking it on to the left corner. What a top pot that was. 16. 36 behind. plenty on the table well played 23 yeah, so close to double pot I mean, hell that wouldn't have mattered either way really would it nice position on the black 24. He won't be too happy with his position here. Oh, 31. no, that's not great. That's not great. That's too at a cute an angle. Well, it goes. Half a chance here. No, 
Not quite. Pretty close, though, oh, but that won't provide any solace. Oh, he's left a red on. Oh, 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 so the comeback Thank was you. almost there. Should hit that harder. One. Should have hit that harder, but never mind. Mark Allen still needs two reds and colours. Three. If we'd have hit that blue in, that would have been amazing. <laughs> Four. He's looking for the snooker behind the black, I think. He's played that very well. That's crafty shot. Mark Allen. Four. It's a very crafty shot, that. He doesn't want to overhit this. Uh, I missed it. Too much of an angle. Hit the He'll be hit disappointed the blues, with that so shot, that's I think. 30 points. Foul on the miss. Mark Allen, five. I can still win the frame. That's an excellent shot. See if he goes for that. Great shot. That's a really good shot. Drumstick trophy. squishies time noise. Tricky part along the cushion here. Go on, in you go. Yes! Well, that's just outstanding. Superb cross. One. He's taking on this pink. Not in the pocket. Oh! Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Tricky shot here. Stop. Am I there? Am I on it? Am I on Nine. it? Riding my luck a little bit here. This won't be easy. If I win this frame, though, that'll be a body blow to Mark Allen. Tricky pot coming up. <laughs> we may not need the mid-session interval. Well, he's taking it on. What a fabulous pot that is. Twenty one. Great opportunity this. Twenty seven. The black to go eight three up and one away. This pot for the frame. And there it is. Thirty four. And the frame. Jim put Cahill. himself one that away with the frame. <laughs> 69. Thank points. you, frame 12. Mark Allen to break.
Cheers, dudes. It's half a chance, but a chance nonetheless. Impressive opening red. One. Okay, on the black. The split looks good to me. It's our first real chance yeah. to take the match. I don't think that'll go. No one. Seventeen. Well, he's lost the cue ball a touch. Would have wanted that under better control, really. Twenty-four. He's attempting to sink this into the left corner pocket. Great shot. Oh, wonderful shot. Uh, and ban. Cheers, dude. Thirty-two. Thirty-three. <laughs> Want to become famous, Lisa? How you doing? Forty. He's lining up the long red to the corner here. No surprises there. Long pots are his speciality. <sighs> 41. Uh, I'm not bad, thank you. I've had three good frames. Three, three, three is a magic number. Good frames. Well, he's looking at potting this into the right corner pocket. No issues there. Uh, he seems full of confidence at the moment. 49. 
Knackers, the 147's off. He's looking at the pot into the left middle. Ah, that's a top shot. Great queuing. 55. That's a sodding shame, that. Tricky shot here. What a wonderful pot. Position looks pretty good to me. That's an absolute real shame. I was going for the 147 there. So, this pot into the right corner. What a top shot that is. Wonderful pot. Outstanding effort. 63. Because Lucas North was asking about that. Do I go for the 147s if I can? Yes, is the answer to that one now. He's going for the left corner pocket. No problem there. <laughs> green grapes. <laughs> what a wonderful. They are green pot. grapes. The games are green grapes. Seven. So this is how bad my sports, my sports depression is. I'm watching a hard player game that I know next nothing about. But you are learning, James. You are learning. This is the key shot. If this goes in, you fancy him for the frame. Oh, went in. No problem there. So that's frame secure. That effectively removes any chance of a comeback in this match. 71. So now can I finish off? In it goes. And that should be this a match become champion no of the European match. Masters. 78. <laughs> Nine points wins. Seventy nine. Can I finish off for a century break though? For snooker manager 2020. Well, you've noticed what the reds are on the table. You've got to go red colour, red colour, right? Until the, the, the reds are gone, then you go yellow, green, brown, blue, pink, and black to finish off. He's aiming to sink this into the right corner. Ninety-four. That's too acute an angle. Challenging pot along the cushion here. He's played that very well with the rest. 95. Tricky pot coming up. Fantastic century. Brilliant. It's a century break. What a way to finish off the match. This is a tricky one along the cushion. Excellent shot. 101. Well, 
that's an unforced error. Oh no! Should have hit it harder. 108. He needs to be wary of under hitting this. So 108 brings the frame, brings the century break, brings the session, and brings the match to an end. Well, it was a really hard shot, and it hasn't worked Great out success. for him at all. Uh, well, guys, thank you very James much for the host, up to six viewers. Mark Allen, four. Frame conceded, frame and match, James Cahill. And that's it. He's done it. The crowd are on their feet and show their appreciation for a great final and two great players. We win the match. We win the tournament. On a century, so I got put out on my centuries list as well. How you doing, man? He joined us just at the end of the stream. <laughs> Thank you for the host. So, the next time. Let's see what we win. Let's see how far we go up in the in the rankings. But let's see who we play next. Here comes the money. Money, money, money. Ooh, look at that trophy. Looks a bit like a gear kin. Yeah, kin. After run that over run by three hours, bloody hell, dude! That must have been a cracking stream. Kyron Wilson got the highest break. Oh, look at that charcoal and blue. Oof, oof. Um, I'm staying safe as much as I can, dude. I mean, I had to go to the infusion yesterday. Yeah, twelve weeks of gaming. 12 weeks of streaming and something that could be very exciting which I need to see if it happens first but if it does I'll let you guys know about it um so I'm up to 11th in the world now 11th in the world we're almost there we've went up what three spots yeah you fusion last week yourself hopefully that went well because um they changed where we were in the hospital so we're away from the main building so much quieter and easier so the next tournament we play all right keep kicking some butt mate we'll catch up soon i'm sure oh absolutely mate you too you stay safe too i'll catch you later So basically your family is flaunting the law, which could get them in trouble. Could get them arrested. So what we will do is we will enter this tournament. So next week, James Cahill will face Chen Thilong in a best of seven. So that you know what that means. Next Friday, after this match, Pogi word wheel comes back on a Friday for a bit. Top. Right. So, ladies and gentlemen, I want to say thank you very much everyone who has joined us tonight for this. For this uh, hour's worth of entertainment. You're very welcome, Michael. You are very, very welcome. Now, who... Yeah, you get a fine. And then if you keep doing it, the fine gets doubled. Which is best. I like that. So who's on for raid? Who should we go raid? <laughs> because oh, I'm going to get ready to play some Diablo 3. Now we could go see the dark room. Uh, we could go see... I mean, Crafty Rebel's still on. Let's go raid Crafty Rebel. Yeah, they, and they, as they should be. If these people are not taking it seriously, they need to be punished for it. Thinking, oh, why should it, why should I do that? Because, before I go, I'll show you something. Hi. <coughs> Oh, 
I'll show you something before I go. Before we raid the crafting. Can't see that very well, can you? No. See? So I got the letter through today for me being home for 12 weeks. So other people can actually get off their ass and stay there for a couple of, for about three weeks at least. So I will see you guys tomorrow on the podcast, 2.15 p.m. UK time, before we switch back to 3.15 the week after, because our clocks go forward at the weekend. Have yourself a very good evening. I will be seeing you later. I have been Lord Maker. You've been, you've been fun to hang out with. And I shall see you then. Bye.